You already know that eating too much sugar is bad, but you're probably still overdoing it. If you still need convincing why you should stop, watch this video. Hello and welcome to Saguaro. We will give you a rundown of how sugar can adversely affect different parts of your body. Stay tuned until the end so we can give you effective tips on how to minimize your daily sugar intake. Please watch the whole video or you'll miss it. Before that, don't forget to smash the like button. Subscribe and hit the notification bell to see more videos on proper diet tips. So how does sugar affect your body? Let's find out what it does to your brain. Eating sugar can give your brain a surge of the feel-good chemical called dopamine. The result? You're more likely to crave a candy bar at midnight rather than a sweet tasting piece of fruit. Your brain will start creating a need for more of that sugar to get the same pleasurable feeling. Whole foods like apples or carrots will not cause your brain to release as much dopamine. How does it affect your mood? Sugary treats like cookies or candies can give you a quick burst of energy or a sugar rush because it raises your blood sugar level fast. But when these levels drop off, your cells absorb the sugar. You will feel anxious or jittery and you will experience the dreaded sugar crash. Eating sugary treats too often can significantly put you at a greater risk of developing depression. What it does to your teeth. You know, your mom was right. You shouldn't eat too much candy. It can rot your teeth. Cavity causing bacteria loves to eat the sugar that lingers in your mouth after you eat sweet treats. How it affects your joints. Eating lots of sweets can worsen your joint pain because it increases the inflammation in your body. High sugar intake can even increase your risk for developing rheumatoid arthritis. How it affects your skin. Eating too much sugar can make you look old fast. Your skin is severely affected by an increase in sugar intake. These excess sugars can attach to proteins in your bloodstream and create harmful molecules collectively called advanced glycation end products or AGEs. These molecules do what their name suggests. They age your skin. AGEs damage the protein fibers, collagen and elastin, which make your skin firm and youthful. You end up with a saggy, wrinkled skin. What it does to your liver. A specific type of sugar called fructose is processed in your liver. If present in a large amount, it can damage your liver. When broken down, fructose is transformed into fat. If this fat builds up, it can cause liver scarring. Scarring can cut off the blood supply to the liver and can lead to liver cirrhosis, which in worst case scenarios may require liver transplants. What it does to your heart. Eating excess sugar can lead to an increase in the insulin levels in your bloodstream. This will affect the arteries all over your body. It causes the walls of the arteries to get inflamed, grow thicker, and become stiff. When this happens, your heart becomes stressed and eventually damaged, which can lead to heart attacks, heart failure, or strokes. What it does to your pancreas. Every time you eat, your pancreas pumps out insulin. If you eat too much sugar, your pancreas will start to pump out even more insulin and it will eventually become overworked. When this happens, your pancreas breaks down. Your blood sugar level will rise, which heightens your risk of developing type 2 diabetes. And you will be more vulnerable to heart diseases. How it affects your kidneys. If you consume too much sugar, your kidneys may be easily damaged. If your blood sugar reaches intolerable levels, your kidneys will start to release excess sugars into your urine. If left untreated, 
you will develop kidney failure. By this time, your kidneys will no longer be able to do their job properly in filtering out waste from your blood. Then you may need dialysis, or worse, a kidney transplant. How it changes your body weight. It's no surprise, the more sugar you consume, the more you'll weigh. Excess amounts of sugar, when present in the body, can inflame your fat cells. This causes the fat cells to release the chemical that will increase your weight. Those who drink sugar-sweetened beverages frequently will tend to weigh more than those who don't. Another potential risk factor of type 2 diabetes. Those are the serious negative health effects of eating too much sugar. If you're concerned, here are some smart ways to help you minimize your sugar intake. Sweeten with fruits. Instead of adding sugar to sweeten your cereals or other meals, try fresh fruits like bananas, strawberries, or cherries. Toss sugar away. Remove sugar or other sweeteners off your table, out of sight and out of mind. If you must use them, then limit sweeteners to just one tablespoon per serving. Water up. Always opt to drink water. If you're craving something else to drink, then try low calorie or sugar-free options. Cut back. Use one third to one half of the sugar that's called for in recipes when baking. Oftentimes, you won't notice a major difference. Read the labels. When shopping, read the list of ingredients and choose products with the lowest amounts of added sugar. That's it. You just watched Too Much Sugar, what those sweets are really doing to your body. Do you have your own sneaky way to avoid sugar? Comment down below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe. Click the notification bell or we'll dump salt in your sugar shaker. Don't forget to check out our other videos.